Hello everyone, this is ThomasFan89 here with a uh, just an update video of what's happening, you know, what's been going on recently, what am I doing, etc. So, this isn't going to be scripted, I just kind of want to keep this casual as possible. Sort of like the opposite of my new custom videos, which have, you know, very clearly are scripted and everything. So I just want to keep this kind of laid back. I don't know how long this will be, this could be really short, this could be really long, so just kind of play it in the background, I guess. I don't know, like, if I'll put a bunch of different pictures up, if I'll put stock footage, if I'll just have this whole thing be one still image. Uh, yeah, I don't know. So, yeah, um, I guess the first order of business is, uh, season four. Season three, after two years, is finally done, and, like, I'm just so relieved it's all over. Oh, boy, that was, uh, season three was, uh, I don't know. It was definitely something. Season four will d be a heck of a lot better, though. Trust me, I've been working on writing season four and you know drafting and getting ideas since this about uh, September of 2016, and now it's November of 2017. So I'm I'm ready to go. <laughs> season four will consist of 30 episodes, unlike the previous, which have, uh, had 10 each. It's gonna be really weird to think that the whole series overall has 30 episodes, and after this season, season 4 will have the same amount of episodes as seasons 1 through 3 put together, which is uh, definitely something to, uh, which kind of like amazes me if I think about it for too long. Um, basically, I'm going to be doing everything in a different style compared to season 3. Season 3 was very, um, everything, you know, there was obviously arcs and stuff, and everything was connected, but it was very like, I guess self-contained in the production of it, of uh, each episode. You know, basically I'd write one episode, I would film the episode, I'd edit the episode, and then i upload the episode as, uh, you know, however long that would take. Usually it took about six months on average. Season four, I'm doing something completely different in that. Basically, um, I've broken up the season into chunks, uh, three ten-episode chunks basically and I'm filming uh, like chunks at a time basically and I've chopped that down so right now I'm filming the first 10 episodes all at once well I'm sort of basically just filming the first four actually the first four episodes take place in like summer slash fall and then six through ten are in the winter so I'm kind of just you know doing those first four first well, my plan is my plan is to just basically get these first 10 episodes to, uh, all filmed and, you know, edit them all together, and then just upload them one at a time, like, you know, over the course of the year, maybe? Depending on how, you know, if I get the uh, next 20 finished. Um, there's still a lot of episodes that need to be translated from, you know, notes and uh, drafts into scripts, but I think it will go good, definitely. Um... I've got, basically, to keep everything in order, I've got a spreadsheet of every set I need to build. I've got everything on my phone stored on the Google Docs app and the Google Sheets app, which, oh, thank goodness I found these, because Microsoft Word is horrible. These are, this is so much better. But, I don't know, I've been keeping track of everything, you know, just, it's a lot easier than just trying to remember everything. You know, I keep everything written down, everything kind of stored away on my phone and stuff, and it, works out nicely. There's a lot of new sets, a lot of new customs that need to be built for this season, but, you know, I'm I'm getting there. It's going it's going really nicely. It's going pretty well. I'm I'm enjoying this. Um I'll be releasing a trailer once these first 10 episodes are done. A uh, little warning though, the first 10 episodes are they're not filler. They're mainly just going to be like little character insights. Like, episode 28, uh, Personal Game, was just basically all about Andy and how he tied into the story. It was all about him. Epi uh, season 4 is going to have a lot of episodes like that, especially the first 10. Um, we will get focus on all the characters. This season is going to be pretty much all about characters and how they adjust to their situations. Uh, the main situation being Thomas's demise, which, uh, if you haven't seen episode 29 already, then, you know, where were you? Sorry for that spoiler, but, you know, that was, um, fall of last year. Oh my god, that was forever ago. Jeez. Um, yeah, there's, we're gonna learn mainly about 
Zero and Lady and Ivo. A bit about Connor, but not really. I'm saving Connor's backstory and stuff for Season 5. I might as well address that now since I brought it up. Um, season 5. Not Season 4, but Season 5 will more than likely be the last season of Quest 89. I, I, you know, I, I could keep going. I could dr go, drag this on as long as I want to, but I don't want to have it be this gigantic thing that never ends, you know, like a, some giant 200-episode anime that just, like, never seems to stop. Um, it has to have a definite beginning, and it has to have a definite end, uh, which will mirror each other. So I've already got the ending planned out, mainly because... I can't do this forever. Like, you know, I, I could, but at the same time, every, all good things must come to an end. If I keep this going for, like, ten seasons, it's just gonna get bad eventually. You know, I'd rather kill it off when it has its dignity. And that sounds really morbid, but if you really think about it, if we go at the same rate that I'm going now, like, season five probably won't come out until, like, 2020 or something. I don't know. Or, like, 2030, you know, because I've been doing like one episode a year because of everything. And that is my computer. I don't know if you hear that. I don't know if you hear the heater in the background either. Um, so yeah, we have 60 episodes left of the series, but don't, don't even think about that. I'm trying to think about that. There are still tons and tons of things that have not been resolved. Some things haven't even been started yet. There's just tons of things left to, you know, discuss and everything. And it's, season four is going to be my finest work, in my opinion. So just wait for that. 2018. I promise it will be worth it. I know these past two years have just been me, like, saying, like, oh, I'll get this done uh, this time. I'll, I'll get it done then. Life just sucks. It just, no matter what happens, something just finds its, finds a way to get in the way of everything. And, um, yeah, it's, I'm, I'm struggling, but at the same time, I'm in a good period right now because I'm just more motivated during this time of the year to get things done. I don't know why. That's just how I am. So, yeah. Um, season 4, 2018. Uh, yeah. The first chunk of it I hope to get out before the summer. And right now, um, let me just check the spreadsheet again. Oh, boy. I'm professional of me. Let me just see. Basically, we've got a good... We've got about a, uh, a pretty good one-third of episode 31 filmed. And then I've got the rest just kind of scattered all over the place with what I've filmed and what I have not filmed. But I'm mainly focusing on the first four right now because the rest will be in the winter. And then, you know, some after that will be in the spring, like setting-wise, not, you know, release date. The season takes place over the course of the year, basically, so, yeah. Okay, enough talk about season four. I don't want to spoil anything because it's gonna. There, there are some things that you know. I've I've told close friends in the community like, oh yeah, I'm I'm planning this and I'm telling you this because like you know you're involved with the season and you're you're voicing this character blah blah blah, or like I'll let people look at the scripts but like, um, not even those select few know what's coming and that's what, um, I guess I'm excited for the most because nobody has any idea of what I've planned. And, uh, yeah. It's, uh, hopefully gonna blow some minds. <laughs> okay, enough season four. Let's get, uh, back on topic with something else. Um, reviews. And I'm not really honest reviews, just reviews in general. I want to do more reviews of just normal things, I guess. Like, I know it's my thing, like, brutally honest, and I'm always, like, screaming and shouting and stuff, but, uh, in, in like, all honesty, those, like, those aren't really as fun to do if, if like, I'm being open-minded here. Well, what, okay, I, I should have worded that better, but, like, they aren't really as fun as they look. Like, I've got to think about everything as I'm going through. Like, I should really take notes on the item or something before I do it. Um, I, I don't know. It's, I, I don't really know what the series is. Like, it's kind of just there. Like, it goes doesn't have a set direction or anything like I was planning on reviewing Magic Railroad but I haven't found the case like that wasn't just a joke like I actually can't find the case um yeah I I don't know what that's gonna be like the uh the whole series 
Um, I've had some thoughts about it recently, and I'm thinking of ending it. And when I say ending it, I don't mean, like, canceling it. I mean, you know, making more videos of it, making more episodes, and then eventually, like, giving it a finale. Like, ending it, you know, giving it a proper send-off instead of me just canceling it. I don't know, though. Like, if I... Maybe I'm just saying that because I didn't enjoy the Thumper review much. I don't know. Maybe I'm just saying that because I haven't done one in a while and I'm just bored all the time. Maybe I'm just... Maybe I actually don't enjoy it, you know. Uh, who knows? I will do more, though. Um, like I said, like, I'll, I want to do actual reviews, like, you know, think ones that are, like, well thought out and, you know, where I'm actually discussing things instead of, you know, screaming and shouting. Another reason is, uh, I can't really find time to do those is because, uh, I usually do those when nobody's home. And it's really hard to find the time when nobody's home. <laughs> There's always people popping in and out of here, like, uh, even in this room probably someone's gonna, like, burst through the door and I'll have to cut this. Um... Yeah, and usually when nobody's home, I just do my homework or take a nap or something. You know, because it's quiet. But, um, yeah, homework. Homework and school and everything is just so hectic. It never ends. Uh, I could go on and on about every little detail, every teeny tiny thing, whether major or minor, and we could be here all night. But nobody wants to hear about my school life and how, like, terrible it is because I'm sure everybody else has the same situation. Nobody likes school. It just takes time away from everything. Blah, blah, blah. You get the deal. So, um, I'm, I'm just working in short bursts, basically. I don't want to burn myself out, sort of like how I did with 30, and the summer, the summer I didn't do much because, like, I was kind of burnt out and at the same time. It's super hot, like, if it's, it's really hot in the summer, and this room doesn't really have climate control, um, so if it's, like, 70 degrees outside, it's, you know, like, 80 in here, you know. Um, there is an electric heater, but that's mainly for the winter. You know, you don't use a heater in the summer, just because. Um, covered season four. Covered the reviews. Um... Reviews, yeah. I didn't mention the last part, I don't think. No. Um, I'm planning on reviewing a movie that came out this year. Um, an animated movie. It's... It was... It was very interesting, the movie. It was actually the, uh, the new Bob the Builder movie? That might sound a little weird, because, you know, I'm mainly focusing on Thomas stuff, but, like, no matter where I go, there's just ads for the show, and, like, I... I watched it, and, uh... I, I really wanted to, like, get my thoughts out there on it and, you know, see what other people think of the movie, but, like, a lot of people I don't think have seen it. Like, I've seen, like, two reviews of the movie. It's like, nobody really cares about the reboot for the show, and I'm like, well, maybe I should do a review on this. Maybe I should get my thoughts out there. Um, I haven't really watched the show that much. I've just kind of, like, you know, watched it for a little bit just to see what it was like, and, uh, I don't know. I might do a review on like the show or the movie, the new the new one, because I've got a lot to say about it. It's uh, not as bad as people say it is, but it's definitely got some major issues. Okay. Um. Next thing will be uh, rem remakes. Oh boy, that that voice crack. I'm just gonna throw it out there now. Sorry if I sound like tired. I guess. Um. This like drowsy, tiredish monotone voice has become my normal voice for the time being. Uh, that's what that's what getting up at 5.20 in the morning does to you, boys and girls. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, remakes. I know I kept saying I was going to do Sydney Sings, and I was like, all right, it's going to be Sydney Sings, and we're going to, I'm going to do this best remake I've never done. Um, That was like 2016, and now it's, that, that was forever ago. Oh, my God. <laughs> Things just slip in and out of my mind, and ugh. I I don't really enjoy doing remakes that much. Like, I like doing little clips. I don't really like remaking full episodes. I'm going to finish it, though, because I don't really like to leave a project half done, um, even though I did do that a lot when I was first starting out with YouTube, especially um, 2015, <clears throat> Real Europe, 
<clears throat> Tale of Two. Um, I will finish that. I don't know what I'll remake next. I really want to remake Cautious Connor because Connor, but, you know, at the same time, I don't because full episodes and stuff. I'd rather focus on season four instead of, you know, going off on this side project for, you know, just a Cautious Connor remake. Uh, speaking of side projects, that kind of segues into my next topic. Um, subscriber specials. Uh... I did, like, music videos, I think, for 100 and 200 subscribers. But then I hit 300, I'm like, okay, I'll, well, that's kind of a big number, at least in my opinion. I should do something better. 400, um, okay. 500, like, I'm almost at 600 subscribers. Like, you guys are, like, multiplying so fast, I can't even keep up with it. I was going to do a music video for 300. Oh, wait, no. Wait a minute, I'm trying to think. Okay, 500, I will do this thing. I have something planned. Um, let's see. On Twitter, I did a poll, and I was like, what do you guys want to see? Do you want to see season, uh, episode 31, episode 1 remastered, both, or a potato? And I got so m and I got 48 votes on that, I believe. That was the most votes I ever got. And the majority of you voted for a video about a potato. Um, asking you shall receive. I will be doing a video of a potato, except that it won't be an actual potato. It will be a thing that looks like a potato, and it'll be called Boulder. <laughs> um, the 500 subscribers... Oh, oh boy. <laughs> the 500 subscriber special will be called Boulder, a short film. Um, I got this idea at, um, what was it, band camp. I was just talking with my roommate, and I got this... I asked a question, like, what would happen if blank... Can't say it because it would be a spoiler... And it kind of just spiraled downhill from there. And now I'm going to be doing something with Boulder. Um, I think it'll be maybe 10 or 15 minutes long. Like a stop motion thing. It'll basically just be the origins of Boulder. What was Boulder's life like before the events of Rusty and the Boulder? Because, um, I don't know, Boulder has just been a thing with me recently this year. <laughs> just go on Twitter, you'll see tons of, you know, Boulder jokes and memes and you know, all this crap that I've done this year with other people. Uh, hashtag boldism. <laughs> uh, that basically covers all of that. Um, uh, we've covered season four, the brutally honest reviews, uh, possible Mega Machines review, remakes, Boulder. Um, I think for the other two specials, I might do music videos. Or I will try to do one of two different ideas. One idea is called, um, yeah, Pringle Express 89 or Polar Express 89. That one's pretty self-explanatory. Only problem is I don't know if I can get that out by Christmas. I haven't even written it yet. I need to watch Pol the uh, Polar Express again if I want to do a parody of it just so I can take notes and, you know, figure out what to do. Um, or I might try to do some other things. I still have another short I need to do, which is a contest entry for Riotron 12. I don't even know if I'll, like, actually do that. <laughs> like, I'm just so tied up with everything. And I only have a, uh, a couple days left for that. But, you know, maybe I'll get something out if I do that. Uh, next, next, next. Um, this is basically just an update for the rest of the year, not, you know, this month. Uh, okay. Right. I've begun a podcast with my friend Oliver, a well, Oliver the GWR11, just, just Oliver. Um, Bringecast, I believe it's called, or Bringle. I can't even remember the name. We recorded it like a couple weeks ago. Uh, yeah, I don't know when that's going to come out. I don't know whose channel it will be on, the pilot episode, um... If it takes off the ground, we'll probably make a separate channel for it. But it's basically us just talking about our lives, and as well as um, things that happen in the fandom or you know in this TV show. And the first episode, we basically talk about weird dreams and season twenty-one. So that'll be interesting whenever that comes out. I'll do a video promoting it when it comes out, whether it's uploaded on my channel or his. So yeah, I don't know when that will be, but hopefully it will be soon. Next topic, um, auditions. 
season four of Quest 89 will have, like, voice actors, because I, I can't do all the voices myself. Um, there's going to be just a massive casting call. Like, pretty much every character will need need a new voice. Uh, Connor, Ivo, Zero, the, some of the humans, the Fat Controller, like, those people will, I will voice still, but pretty much everybody is going to change. Um, basically, yeah, just I'll need tons and tons of people. But I'll be doing a separate video on that once I have, you know, some of Season 4 edited. So, uh, let's see. Next topic. Uh, I think I've covered pretty much everything. Um... I think I might want to do a Q&A for 300 subscribers or 400, maybe just, you know, 300 subscribers. Because I have gotten a lot, you know, recently of subscribers, and I've gotten, like, a couple of, like, questions recently. But, um, I think a Q&A might be good, because the last time I did a Q&A was when I had, I think, 100 or 150 subscribers, and now I'm almost at 600, so... There's a lot more people with probably a lot more questions, hopefully. Um, I don't know if I'll do that or not. If I do, I will upload a separate video, just having people, like, you know, ask, ask me your questions. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I'll do that or not, so don't ask any questions here, because I'll, I'll just delete them or ignore them or something. So, yeah, everything that I mentioned, like, all the videos... They don't have a set release date. They will come out whenever. They will come out when I get them done, when I have the time. Um, you know, I haven't really done much this year or last year. But I feel like quality over quantity. You know, I would rather release, like, one really big, long episode a year versus, like, tons of short two or f two to five minute episodes, each, you know, like, a year... But I'm, I'm definitely going to be stepping up my game, though. You know, I promise we will have at least more than one episode next year. Um, my goal is 10 out of the 30 that I have planned, or, you know, or more. But we will see. Reviews, I will do them whenever. Just, yeah. I don't know where to go with the series at the moment, for brutally honest. I've got a few ideas, but, you know, I'll have to figure that out. Uh, Mega Machine slash Bob the Builder reboot review because why not? Um, if anybody actually wants to see that, then just comment down below. I'll, I'm definitely considering doing that because not many other people have discussed it, and I I want to put my thoughts out there to kind of create some discussion. Uh, remakes. I'll finish Sydney Sings whenever. Uh, I might start other remakes, you know, at different times. I might just do a bunch of clips for a little while. Just to kind of test out my new skills and stuff and set and Oh! Crap, I didn't even mention... Um, I got new wallpaper. I don't know if you noticed, but in the uh, video I did showcasing Connor and Caitlin's coaches, I got I had new wallpaper. It's the same pattern as the old one, except it's a lighter shade of blue. And I think it gives a lot more life to the uh, sets. And I have tons of it now. I have like four rolls left, so I'm going to make different variants. I'm planning on making like evening slash morning skies. Um like nighttime or something. I might use black poster board for that, I don't know. But um, I'm planning on making tons of different variants. I can, I'm can. i going to make the sets bigger. I want to get a grass mat or something so I can take up the entire table and just make huge sets instead of just that little with, little one with my little carpet. Um, a lot of my sets were really small for season four, three, uh, except for certain instances like in 30 where I, or some parts in 29 where I'd put two boards together to make one big sky section and you know the poster board does have a couple creases and cracks in it and you can see a little bit of that on the wallpaper but I'd rather have that than a giant gap between two giant boards of wood that are it's like easily noticeable so yeah um I got off topic there yeah season four review review remake podcast i don't know when that's gonna come out it could have come out tomorrow it could come out in january who knows uh oh yeah the boulder thing don't know when i'm gonna get started on that 
Um, I'm gonna consider that to be the true five year anniversary video, just because I didn't really like the music video. I just did that, you know, to get something out. The Boulder video will be considered the true video. I'll get that done whenever. You know, my goal is January. I want to get started on that at least after 31, maybe? I don't know. I got a lot of stuff to build for that. I have to build a lot of sets out of Legos. A lot of, like, building interiors. Uh, we'll figure that out, though. And, uh, I believe that is everything. Except the Q&A, but I'll decide on that. So, we will see soon. I've just kind of been, like, you know, laid back a lot throughout this video because I just kind of want to be, like, really transparent and honest and upfront about everything. Um, I don't know when things will get released. I don't know when I'll get done with stuff, you know, in all honesty. You know, I want to I say, like, every other update video, I, I want to say, like, oh, yeah, I'm going to hopefully get this done by September or get this in August. But no, that's, you know, that's not nearly... That's just, like, setting too high of an expectation, really, for myself. Uh, things will get done when they get done. I'm, you know, I'd rather take my time and, uh, you know, get things done that way than just rush everything and have it be a giant mess. That's everything. Except for one last topic. Okay, I forgot. Season 1. A remaster of Season 1 of Quest 89. Because, basically, you want to watch new episodes, you're going to get lost. So you're going to have to go back and watch the old episodes. And they suck, quality-wise. I'm not just redoing the visuals and stuff. I am starting from the ground up. I have rewritten episode one completely. And I have a small test audience, which I've gotten all positive feedback from so far. Uh, except for, you know, people that have not responded back yet. But um, it's definitely going to be something. I want to maybe start on that after these first ten episodes of season four are done. And hopefully get season one remastered. Um done next year and like release it by Christmas 2018 so like the last episode lines up with Christmas I don't know okay that's that's everything you know hopefully I didn't forget anything I summarized everything then I added on the season one remaster so yeah okay I think that is all so thanks for listening because I'm probably just not going to Put any footage here. Just thanks for listening to me ramble on about stuff. Uh, this is... I, I didn't want to write a script for this and just be like, today I'm going to be talking about this. I plan to, you know, I... That, that makes it more professional, but at the same time it doesn't because I feel like I'm just kind of... Not lying, but I'm just being like, don't worry, I will get this done. You know, it's kind of like automated almost. You know, here this way, I'm like, you know, talking in my voice and I'm obviously tired and everything, but... You know, it's, I like it better this way just because I'm getting my thoughts out, you know, more naturally instead of writing them down and you know, summarizing and drafting and all that crap. So, uh, yeah, new content is coming. I don't know when, but it's coming. And when it's coming, it will, you know, when it's done, it will be good. Hopefully. You will all be the judges of that. Thank you all for sticking me with, uh, sticking with this channel for so long. Um, yeah. Five years just ended a few days ago, and, well, it's, uh, it was really good, and hopefully I'm going to be here for five more, even longer, hopefully, you know, who knows. But, yeah, that that's it, really. I'm just going to turn this off before I ramble on some more. The basic summary of this, I have a lot of things planned. I don't know when they'll come out, but when they come out, um, they will be some of the best things that I've made for this channel. So, new content coming. Don't know when, but it is coming. So, just uh, stay tuned, stick around. Uh, don't know how long it'll be, but when it comes, it will be definitely something out of the ordinary. So, thanks for listening. This is uh, Nick TF89 signing out. And, crap, one last thing. I have a new logo, a little slash profile picture. That was done by Sudrian Engine. He is awesome. Go check him out. He, he does he does great stuff. Okay, that's it now. Okay, bye.